Welcome to my YouTube channel. Please subscribe to my channel for more recap today. We want to do a movie recap title, All's Fair in Love. The movie opened with the news on television, talking about the great achievements of Demi and Canla in the fashion industry. Demi and Canla are not just successful fashion designer, but they also found fun, living a lavage lifestyle, clubbing, drinking, sleeping with different women and spending cash. Demi and Canla are best friend who share same goal and purpose in pushing their dreams in the fashion industry. Canla was the brain behind the design of clothes and bring different fashion style to beat the market. Why Demi bring the fund and finances this ideal? Together they form a strong team beyond just friendship. But Demi father is against this friendship, as he see Canla as a spoiled child who only know how to spend money and live lavage and spending. This idea of friendship and business partner is not good for his son. Demi was angry with his father for uninviting his friend to the family dinner as he show his frustration to his father, but happened to cross apart with a beautiful lady, who will change both friends' life. Eventually Demi came across same lady, and she gave her some ideas on how to meet a client he needed to push his brand. Both friends are in search of a business consultant, that will help their business break through the international market, and attract potential clients so they interview various participant, at the point when all hope is lost. Flower the lady both friends cross part came in, happened she also apply for the job position, they wear both shock. She introduce herself and share her ideas on how to push their brand, across border listing different brand she has worked with. They were so impressed, and offer her the position of consult Demi approach Kanla to discuss his feeling for Flower. Both friends didn't having feeling for her, and agreed to keep it as business only Kanla chat her to know if she already know who he was. First time they met at the bar which she agreed to but both friends could not hide their desire for her. As she was too beautiful to resist Demi, and Canla flout with her Demi took her out on a date behind business hour, and both share moment. Same as Canla also took her on a date, she was business flouting with both friends. It takes no time as she start demanding for money to push their ideas, and get client Demi took her out on a date for an art museum, where he asked her about her feeling for his friend Canla which she said she see him as a brother. This statement put a smile on Demi. Their date was cut short, when his dad happened to be in the same art museum, approached them. He took no time to show his displease on his son, and both exchange words he was talk out by his sister to calm down. She also share moment with Kamla. He tried to ask her about the relationship with Demi but ignore it with a kiss. She went out with both friends in different occasion, And different days she organize a business meeting with a potently client for them, who show interest in their fashion brand and ready, to invest only if he is given 25%. This did not go well with them, as the meeting come to conclusion with no positive outcome it was reviewed that all this was a plan to scam them. As she report back to her boss, who also notice officially behavior from her, she warn her to be careful, and not fall in love with them, or she will feel her worth Demi, was on his way to meet with Flower to take her out, only to see her with Kanla. Both friends share a hot argument that nearly lead to a fight then. It was clear to Kanla that they both been used. Kanla went back home only to be approached with a gun where he demi seated with some arm official. Then it was known to them they are from the financial crime department and they are about to be scammed. Flower in every business meeting was a trap to scam them. So they both agreed to fight back, and come with a plan to deal with the scammer. Working along with the official flower approach both friends to ask for forgiveness and accept any outcome of their decision, even if it's to lose her job, but unknown to her they have know all about her plans to scam them. So they play along to continue the deal but on 15%, she informed this to her boss, and the new agreement to 15%. The day of the fashion walkway was set, as business and different partner was on ground even, his dad. It was a success and Demi was approached by the client, who told him he has agreed to the 15% to his surprise. Demi decided to change the figure, down to 5% because of the success of their event, making the scam difficult. Their boss did not take it likely to this information, so she kidnapped both friends to a warehouse where she threatened them to sign the deal. She went as far to kidnap Demi cousin, and willing to kill her if he refused so he buy into it. 
and decided to sign out his brand to her. But was cut short as the police burst into the warehouse to arrest all the scammer they were all saved thanks for staying by. Please do well to subscribe to my YouTube channel.